News now out of Hartford, where the Trinity College campus is mourning the loss of a student who died suddenly. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Matthew Campbell is live outside campus. And Matthew, what are police telling you tonight? Well, Dennis, this death is mysteriously sad. Police are still investigating, but right now they say this just appears to be a tragic, sudden death. Now, this is what we know right now. Uh, the student, Hartford Police tell us, the student was 23-year-old senior Chase Hyde. On Sunday, they say he was feeling ill. The only symptoms released tonight is that Hyde was vomiting. On Monday, Hyde was found unresponsive. Police, fire, and an ambulance were called to one of the on-campus apartments on Crescent Street and found Hyde. The Trinity senior was was later pronounced dead. A toxicology report was done, and we're still waiting on the results. An autopsy is also being done, but right now police are saying foul play does not appear to be a factor, and this does not look like a suicide, nor does it appear that drugs were involved. So the Trinity campus just stunned by this sudden death. A memorial was held this afternoon, and grief counselors will be here all week. Now, this death prompted us to ask if this could have been an infectious outbreak. Both the state and the college are confirming absolutely not, and they are saying that the public's health is not at risk. That is the latest live here at Trinity tonight. Matthew Campbell, Channel 3 News.